Okay, so here's the mini that I made to go inside the box. And this is a toilet paper roll mini album, so it's not so big. And uh, here's the spine of the album. I just uh, used some creme, uh, la creme papers from DCW V. Uh, not V, but V. <sighs> My English. <laughs> and some <laughs> ribbon, uh, ribbon bows. And on the back here, uh, I just uh, went around the edges here with some more of the Lacey Jose trim. And uh, this is some, uh, like this dollar store uh, pearl uh spray no not spray pearl flourish yeah <laughs> and these are just uh, cut out from a, a bead trim and some lace so pretty simple and of course uh making this i had to <laughs> make a huge mistake and so i did uh originally i had this frame here back here until i discovered that i had glued everything i mean the cover everything upside down on the album so i had all the openings because uh all the pockets have openings up here and um <laughs> i had glued down the everything upside down so i had to change <laughs> change it all and uh that's why the photo frame ended up here on the cover instead uh, i made a bow and i made um, a little butterfly from a mulberry flower and some uh, some things <laughs> and pearls and uh, this uh, was made following Kelly's tutorial and uh, I found Kelly's tutorial after the uh, tip from uh, uh, Leonie hi Leonie <laughs> I just love Leonie's uh, butterfly she makes them a lot prettier than I do but I'm still practicing so hopefully I can manage in the future and uh, these are just some uh, beaded sprays here uh, this is from Lizzie Jose it's a beautiful crystal and um, these rosebuds are so pretty and they're I am roses and these are also I am roses flowers and I love these I think these are the R40s and uh, this is an I am roses uh, cherry blossom and here's a little crystal flower from um, uh, from Lizzie, and um, a crocheted flower from I am Roses. And this is just uh, a button that I glued down. And uh, this button is from Tim Holtz. And uh, I made a closure with a, an elastic velvet uh, ribbon, and. Um, it opens up like this okay, so I'll just put this back where it belongs first okay so the first two pages are here and um, another butterfly with some bling and uh, a stamp I've made pockets uh, this uh, these pockets I've never made these before it's just a cut slit in the paper I, I got the tip from Anna uh, on her tutorial for <clears throat> sorry for making the tropical travelogue uh, album i'll put a link to her tutorial below it's completely awesome you you learn so much from watching her tutorials and she's an amazing artist and uh, i made another one here and uh, the tip that she has goes to like this you just put some some tape on the back of your paper so that when you cut it doesn't tear that easy um so great tip and thank you so much and uh, i made this a uh, uh, little uh, dome it's a it's like oh sorry guys <laughs> i'm really struggling to find the words uh, i really don't know it's a resin dome i think that's what it's called it's a sticker so behind i uh, there is a stamp here stamped image and i put this resin uh, piece on top it just glues and sticks to the paper so it's perfect and again i went around it with this uh, bling trim from lacy jose and a feather so uh, this thing here is held close with the magnet and it opens like this and there is a stamp uh, stamped image it's uh, the eiffel tower and um, it opens like this and again like this and, um, and this is the stamp and this tag here is just glued down and 
on another stamped image. So you can you can put your pictures there or do some journaling or whatever you like. And uh, yeah, how close with the magnet? This is um, just a, a tag here, and I just love these uh, little shoes that I made. Uh, I used for the pulls. Um, a dear friend of mine, Malin, she uh, she's a scrapper girl. So, and I'm hoping to see her on YouTube uh, soon. <laughs> Hi, Malin. <laughs> and uh, I borrowed uh, this uh, wonderful die from her, and uh, it's I think it was a, a Sussex die. I'm pretty sure it's Sussex, and it's beautiful. And I was telling her that I made, I was making this Marie Antoinette uh, album and box, and she said, "Oh, I got the perfect die for you." So she was so sweet, and she lent it to me. So thank you so much, Malin. And uh, I used it for the the pulls of uh, the tags here in this album. So here's the the next two pages. I bound um, these toilet paper rolls uh, by actually cutting the side here and made sort of like an accordion uh, here and I glued each uh, side of the toilet paper roll to this little accordion uh, thing here uh, to make the pages and to make the album sturdy and easy to to flip through so I'm pretty happy with how this turned out and I put some ribbon here in the center to cover up the, the paper and um, yeah, this is just uh, a belly band made with some ribbon and I have some uh, pearl trim, silver pearl trim here from Lizzie Jose to, to just stop the, the pull out from falling through. And um, uh, yeah, how does this work? Well, this is a tag from the paper. Oh, and uh, I also used some, I think they're my mind's eye uh, papers, um, metal arc collection and they come with some great die cuts and uh, this is a stamp on a ribbon and this here just opens up like this and these flip open like so and this is not attached all the way down so you can put tags or something behind here and here's another like belly band thing and it holds this closed like so so i'll not try to put that back inside because i know i never can <laughs> when i'm on, ca on camera so here again uh, a lot of room for photos even though it's uh, a small mini and um here's another tag and the page you can put a picture here if you want this is an acetate pocket with some some ribbon and a stamp and uh another tag up here a this is um just um the shoe die that i was talking about this is a long version here of the of the boot and i just used it in the corner here and i didn't glue it completely down so uh yeah and this opens so a lot of room and i made this uh, frame here i embossed some black cardstock and i put this uh, bling trim around and there's a stamp a stamp from the heart in here and uh it's not attached all the way down, so you can slip the photo under. Here's another uh, belly band. This is elastic, and I put some bling trim across. And this uh, cute little butterfly here, look, it's really pretty. I got it from Annie, Miss Garden Grove. But thank you so much, Annie. It's really beautiful. It was perfect for this album. And uh, I made some tags that I put inside here. This one I didn't make. This is from the Metal Art, but I stamped it on the back here. So another little shoe pull tag in here and then the next page here's one of the beautiful cameos that I recently got and uh, it's got a metal backing here I colored it it was originally gold uh, so I made it like a pearl silver color to match the the pages in the album bling trim love the bling trim Lizzie <laughs> and uh, some uh, uh, some of this lace here. I backed the lace with some white paper so that it wouldn't like look too uh, messy with the, the background pattern and the lace. So it looks a bit uh, more quiet. <laughs> and here's a frame here. And uh, again, what did I do here? Not much, I think. <laughs> so that's the last page you can just fit a, a picture here 
and uh, another one of the boots as tag pulls put one on each side and yeah the back of the album so that's my project guys uh, i really hope you like it i had so much fun uh, making this and and the box here a marie antoinette box really tons of fun to make and um i'm going to show you some of the cameos that i got and i'll link to the sellers uh, below i got some really gorgeous cameos uh it's they are all etsy sellers and these are so detailed and pretty and i got them thanks to malin again my friend uh she gave me a tip of this uh, seller called kathy's jewels i think and um they're really pretty and she sent me i think these were like a, a free gift these tiny 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 cameos they're like mm, a quarter of an inch uh, wide i think really pretty <laughs> and i used one uh on my album or box and i got these butterfly cameos here gorgeous pink and uh, yeah just a whole lot uh, the prices are like so affordable and uh, she's got so many different designs and I love this little cherub here a lady yeah so just loads and loads and great prices uh, I also got some from some other sellers and just a second I'll point. yeah I got these uh, it's a lady and a deer in the forest it's really beautiful i got these uh, small ones here but they're not as tiny as you can see this is like a small one but this is even smaller so um i also got these uh, dragonfly ones really beautiful and uh, here's a fairy and some more like um, an angel yeah and uh, the three sisters a lovely lady here a butterfly some more fairies love fairies <laughs> and a larger version 30 by 40 and yeah another larger one of the uh, the gorgeous dragonflies so these are my cameos i went cameo crazy as you can see <laughs> and uh yeah and oh also one of the sellers has got some really nice beads i don't know if she still has them but they're really worth checking out they're, these are glass beads really pretty on your stick pins and look at these like lace glass uh, just a second i'll have to take them out and show you because they're so pretty okay let's see if we can get light enough to show maybe if i have a white background beautiful if you visit her shop uh i'll put the link below you can see a much clearer and better picture of these but these are even more beautiful in real life so well yeah this is uh, what i had to share with you today and uh, thank you so much for watching i hope you like my box and album and uh, i hope to see you again soon have a nice day Bye bye